While Ukraine continues its fight against Russia, in Washington, Congress is fighting itself, with lawmakers failing to agree on how to extend aid to Ukraine. The Ukrainians have had to start rationing their munitions, as any sensible army would, because they simply don't want to run out. $111 billion Congress already sent Ukraine is nearly gone. The Biden administration proposes sending about another $60 billion to Ukraine and $46 billion more to Israel, Taiwan, and operations at the U.S. southern border. We can't let Putin win. President Biden backed the bill hours before a procedural Senate vote, criticizing the Republicans expected to sink it. History's going to judge harshly those who turn their back on freedom's cause. The question that we should be asking is why does Joe Biden not want to secure the border? A Homeland Security official says authorities encountered more than 10,000 migrants along the U.S. southern border on Tuesday alone. Senate Republicans say no Ukraine is real aid without more focus on immigration policy. The vote will just indicate, yeah, we're, we're serious. We meant what we said. We said what we meant. It's they who have injected border into the Ukraine issue, even though the two are unrelated. Senate decorum has dissolved behind closed doors. A classified Ukraine briefing Tuesday turned into a shouting match over the border. Senators leave for the holidays late next week, meaning time to agree and act is running out along with funding. In Washington, I'm Emily Schmidt reporting.